two little Briggs motors. The one on the left, I believe, is going to be a 1957 6 BS, 6 cubic inch. B stands for the aluminum uh, block, and uh, S stands for the suction carburetor. One on the right is a 60,000 series 60102. Uh, again, same setup, aluminum block, suction carburetor, and uh, 6 cubic inch. However, there is a difference. The one on the left has a different bore and stroke than the one on the right. The one on the left has a 2 inch bore and stroke and uh, that works out to be a little bit less displacement than the one on the right which has a bigger bore 2.38 inch and uh, one and a half inch stroke so they make the power differently the one on the left is not going to be as rev happy as the one on the right and uh, the one on the left is rated at about 1.6 horsepower at 3200 rpms you could probably nudge 1.75 horsepower if you're willing to wind it up to 3600 but it's not going to be real happy up at that spinning speed the one on the right is a two horsepower engine as depicted in the, uh, the little ID on the uh, or sticker on the cow uh, the one on the left is rather interesting to me because it's got two ID tags on it uh, and I'll uh, show you that uh, it's got the one stamped on the on the uh, cowl and it's got one stamped on its little plate on the side uh, and oddly enough they match I found that to be very curious so I went into it checked the bore and stroke looked at the flywheel on the back of the flywheel they put a, a date stamping and uh, sometimes on the coil too it has the early what I call four post mounting coil and the early flywheel and the flywheel depicts that it was made at least a flywheel now I don't know when the engine was assembled in uh, May of 1957 so this was at the transition where Briggs was phasing out the cast iron twin to this engine the uh, 6S and moving into the aluminum block and at the same time they were also changing the way they stamped the ID on the cow that was a new thing uh, the side plates were basically the old era so this it's possible it could have slipped through the uh, factory or maybe they were running a test on uh, the cow stampings who knows uh, this one here no funny stuff going on here uh, it measures out at 2.38 inch bore because it's a little bit later uh, engine in the uh, 60,000 series and uh, stickers and everything match up fine no suspicions I almost forgot to tell you that the little motor on the right uh, the cow stamping states that it was made on uh, September the 27th of 1966 and I confirm that the flywheel states that it was made in August of 1966. So it's usually a little lag before they put the, the parts together. So no, again, suspicions, uh, particularly with the engine on the right. We're going to go ahead and run these. And uh, they both run real good, real, real good.